I've got to write this point, give the coordinates of this point in three different ways. One of them must have a negative r, one of them must have a negative theta or a negative angle. How do I do these polar coordinates? Well, you've got to get, by angle, you've got to get to where the point is on the line here, somewhere on that line. And then you have to give a distance from the origin. So this, this ring is one, this ring is two, this ring is three, etc. And I'm gonna delete those because I don't want them getting in my way. So there's a number of ways I, uh, we can do this. I can do this. First, I can go this direction. Clockwise is negative degrees, and I went negative 60 degrees. I went from 360 to 60. So I have negative 60 degrees. You can write this in uh, radians too. I'll do that in a second, negative 60 degrees. And then since I'm going towards my angle, or towards my edge that I just made to get from the origin, then R is positive, one, two. I went two, negative 60. So that's one way to write this thing is two, negative 60. I'll do each one in a different color. Another way to write it is to use the positive angle. So I go all the way around to 300. And since I'm going from the origin towards my edge there that I drew the angle on, it's going to be a positive R. So it's 2, comma, 300 degrees. Wait a minute. We need a minus R too. Okay, I'll give you a minus R. Uh, let me do this one in green. I can go here to 120 degrees. So it's going to be 120 degrees. And then I'm going away from that edge that I just made, so it's a minus R, minus 1, minus 2. So minus 2, 120 degrees. So I've got three different ways to give the same point. One has a negative R, one has a negative theta. If we want to make this in uh, radians, you might have all these memorized. I do not. So I'm going to have to convert 60 times pi over 180. Well, I know what that is. That's pi over 3. So this is 2 comma negative pi over 3. 300 degrees. Again, you may have these memorized. I have to do the conversion because right now I don't. Uh, 4 times uh, 2 times 6. 6 times 5 is 30. 6 times 3. So this is 2 and then 5 pi over 3 radians. That's another way to do it. And then 120 degrees times pi over 180. Uh, 4 goes into 12 3 times. 4 doesn't go into 18. 6 goes into 12 twice. 6 goes into 18 3 times, so 2 pi over 3. This is negative 2, comma, 2 pi over 3. Three different ways. There's a lot of different ways you can do it. You can go all the way around twice and then go to, and same thing. So there's a lot of different ways you can write this point. That's it.